Hi, it's Deanna here from Mini Beast Wildlife and today we're going to show you how to set up an enclosure for the rainbow stag beetle. Now you can make your enclosure as elaborate and as beautiful as you like with plants and rocks and all sorts of things inside there. But today I'm just going to show you a really simple way of keeping them that provides for all of the beetle's needs and it's very basic. So uh, I'll put this one down, he's feeding on some banana right now but I'll use him a bit later on to put in our terrarium. So we're going to start off with a terrarium just like this one. Any container that has a secure lid with ventilation will do, but uh, these terrariums are a perfect size for our beetles. So we'll just take that lid off. There we go. And we've got some cocoa peat substrate here. Uh, this is a perfect substrate for your beetle. It retains its moisture really well, and uh, the beetles can burrow through it as they love to do. So that's really easy. We'll pour some of that in our terrarium. So these beetles like to bury themselves under the substrate so if you want to have them out more often don't make the substrate quite as deep so about three to five centimeters is perfect so we're just going to pad that substrate down to give it a bit more substance at the bottom there all right now these beetles feed on banana so it's really easy to feed them and uh, we suggest to put a piece, a fresh piece of banana in there every two days or so, but obviously check your beetle every day to make sure that it uh, hasn't eaten through its entire food piece. So basically we just put our banana and our beetle in the terrarium like that. Now you can put in some uh, shelter for your beetle if you like, some leaves or uh, something like that for it to shelter under. But other than that, that's as easy as it can be. The beetle will be really happy in there as long as you're providing the food for it and uh, making sure that the substrate is nice and moist. So every day, come in and check the substrate. If it's looking a little bit dry, give it a good spray down with a misting bottle. And otherwise, your beetle will be perfectly happy in a simple enclosure just like this. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time when we tell you more about our amazing invertebrates.